So, hi, my name is James Hunt. I am a director at Vivanti, a data consultancy that specializes in Fivetran, Snowflake, and DBT. Uh, my talk submission for Coalesce 2023 is called Set Theory and Data Validation, Better Living Through DBT Macros. Um, this is a talk about data validation. I'm going to go through how we at Vivanti uh, do data validation uh, with our customers, how we use DBT, and how we use macros. Uh, my main emphasis is going to be on the different types of validations that you can do, uh, what they are, how they work, etc., and how we would implement them in DBT. This talk is intended for people who have written a SQL query or three, and then been asked to justify the outputs or the results, the table, the view, or the elaborate transformation pipeline. Um, usually this is the app against some sort of target data set. Can you match Kathy's numbers from uh, finance? Can you, can you match Greg's report out of the business reporting uh, department? Uh, my audience, I'm hoping, will come away from the talk uh, with a newfound appreciation of some of the SQL fundamentals and mainstays, including minus accept uh, and full adder joins, uh, as well as ideas on how to automate validation at scale uh, with macros, validating views, uh, and a path forward um, in bringing DBT testing uh, to bear on uh, their validation problems. To me, this talk is about bringing more rigor and more engineering discipline into what is sometimes a very ad hoc approach to checking numbers. Um, it's about understanding the types of things that can go wrong in a data transformation project, the types of things that can go wrong in data modeling, uh, not just at the beginning, not just when you're developing from the beginning and the first principles, right? Not just the first round of big sets of transformations, but also the day two and day 200 stuff. Um, small changes here and there over time uh, start to cause issues where if you're not running the same validations you ran at the beginning, uh, you're going to have issues. I gave a precursor of this talk to the inaugural meeting of the Washington DC area DBT meetup group. Uh, and I got a lot of positive feedback. A lot of people thought there was some interesting content there. Uh, and I think the audience enjoyed it quite a bit. Several people told me they learned something new about DBT macros. Uh, a lot of people were very excited to go back to their, uh, to their businesses, to their jobs, uh, and to their hobby projects to apply some of the things that they learned. I do plan to go into a little bit more technical detail than I did in the uh, shorter time frame of the meetup format. Uh, and go into a little bit more onto the DBT macro side. When I gave this talk at DC, it was primarily about a, it was more of a tales from the field kind of talk. Uh, I was talking about a particular project we had just come off of uh, that required a fair amount of validation against uh, customer supplied files and all the kinds of things that went wrong and how we built this validation framework kind of in response to that and a couple of other things uh, that projects we had worked on in the past with other clients, both large and small. I've been a consultant for 20 some odd years, working in the data space, working in the cloud space. Uh, I've spoken at several conferences uh, and I was at Coalesce last year in New, uh, Louisiana, New Orleans. Uh, it was a great conference and I am thrilled to uh, be given the opportunity to be a part of this year's Coalesce.